how to make a block in Eclipse for Minecraft. So you open up client src net.minecraft.src and you make a new class and you name name it mod underscore whatever you want. So I'm gonna put mod underscore tutorial and then you put extends base mod and then right here add unimplemented methods I'm just gonna remove these so now this is your basic mod you can start making the blocks so I'm gonna put I'm gonna start making a block and first thing you type in public static final block tutorial equals new block tutorial and then you can put in 180 or any number it's that block ID Hi, you can put in a number that's not already used so yeah and this is the material and you can put in any of these materials so that's like if it's glass when you break it it'll sound like glass on this if you select it so I'm just gonna select stone rock oh that's <laughs> rock and now there's an error here and that that error is basically this is not a class and it needs to be a class new class block tutorial so there you go you made your block tutorial class and now you put extends block right there click this add constructor erase it up to int and you put i comma material material without a comma in between material both materials now you can put Oh, oopsies. I, comma, material. Like that. So, this is, this is finished. You don't need that anymore. Well, you still need it, but you don't need to do anything more to it. Now you put dot set, block name, uh, set block name. Yeah, and then you put in a name for it, and you're done with this right now. So now you can put in mod loader dot register block, and you put in real or you put in whatever you have here. Tutorial. Let me go on. Mod loader. Dot. Name. Tutorial. Tutorial block. Like that. And you go mod loader. Dot. Add recipe. New. Item stack stack you can delete this and you put in the name right here tutorial comma however much you want out of this crafting recipe so I want ten and now you go comma new object square thing this that and that. Now, in here, in the middle, is where you make your recipe. So, go like that, put a, some quotation marks down, and these are the, this is the crafting grid. If you have, this is the top row, and then you'd have another one here.
That'd be the second room. And then you'd have another one here, which would be the bottom room. So you can change these for a bunch of different things. And now you just go hit this, whatever that is. I don't know what it is. It's the key, like the same key that is the um, quotation marks. And you can put in one of the symbols. And you s now you have to say what it is. So you put comma, block, or item. So block dot dirt. And that would mean this equals some dirt. So you'd have to put nine pieces of dirt in a crafting table to make your tutorial block. And if you put item dot pickaxe diamond, so you mean you have to put nine diamond pickaxes and stuff like that. Now you if you want to change the texture, you can go mod loader dot add override tutorial. Oh not tutorial. Slash terrain dot png red png and that's just a, a picture for a block that I have in my Minecraft. So for that, you need to make a sixteen by sixteen block, like just a texture, like sixteen by sixteen picture. Draw whatever you want, and you. Drop it in there, which I already have. And now you have to go block index in I I don't actually know how to do it right now. I think I, I forgot how to do it. But you need to put like block index in texture dot mod loader dot or add add overwrite so I'm gonna figure that out and come back to you okay uh, I found out what you do you actually put tutorial block dot or the name of your block dot block index in texture and then it will work so I'm gonna play this the little green button and it'll load up I'm going to go into survival mode. Okay, I have some dirt. Oh, there's a the puzzle. I'm just going to turn it down. I'm going to grab some more dirt. Almost enough. There we go. Enough dirt. Or enough, yeah, enough dirt. And now I have ten tutorial blocks. Yeah. And if I turn the sound up, it sounds like wood. But you see, they break with one hit. So, how to solve that is with block settings which are in this main or with it or in this uh, public static final string thing you put dot set hardness and the, it's a float so you put if you want it to be super hard you would put like 10 point zero f which is a float so now if I play this I'm probably going to need a pickaxe to break it. And you can dot, like, go dot set blast resistance. And then if you put it, like, really high, it would never break for, for, uh, from, like, TNT or creepers or anything. You can make a creeper proof house. Okay, now. Now. It'll take a long time to break. You'd probably need a wooden pickaxe, so I'm gonna try. I'm gonna grab one of those and see if I can break with that. But I don't think I will be able to. Oh, 
I'm gonna drop that down to like six. <clears throat> drop it down to six float. Oh yeah, I can break it with this. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna change this to like six. And that is the basics on how to make a block. Goodbye.